I was minding my business on the training ground when I suddenly get a notification on my phone. What could this be, I wonder. So I open up my phone and I see breaking news. Breaking news. A Liverpool player has reportedly been in talks with the championship side because she hasn't had a chance to show her worth. She is said to go for a reported £40 million to give Liverpool enough to get a replacement. Did Liverpool waste a good talent? And that player was Shiloh. I told the coach about this and she fixed it up with Shiloh because Shiloh wanted to play more games. She felt undervalued at the squad, so we decided to play her in every single cup game that we play that is not a final. And if she proves herself, she'll be in the final team. So that's that's the new rule we've put out. But as I'm going home, I get another notification on breaking news where it shows that five Liverpool players are going to go on a Greece holiday for four weeks. And they're unknown as of now, but they're going to be found out after our Europa League game up against Toulouse. So I debated on telling this to the manager, but I decided I wanted to have Maccas instead. So, yep, went there, had a good meal. I don't know why the f- Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to another video on the channel for episode number two of the Liverpool, uh, custom Liverpool career mode. Um, yeah, um, thank you all so much for the support on the first episode. It's been a pretty good, like, first episode, really. I'm gonna go to Australia. We'll go for six months, why not? And we'll go technically gifted and any. I feel like getting an Australian into the side would be good. Also, I'd like to um, correct myself in what I said at the start of the first episode. Jurgen Klopp has not moved on. He has not been sacked. He's just been moved up to the board of objectives. Um, he's trying to get all these done because he knows the long-term signings. He's trying to get that down. But John Henry's still at the club, and I don't think he will um, leave it. So, yeah, I really, really think we'll be able to get rid of the brain exposure. But Emmy Martinez is injured. That's probably why they've got, gone on a two-game unbeaten run forever. Yeah, I guess this isn't, I guess this isn't happy. They're going to... I'm gonna keep the lineup as it is. Maybe we'll, we'll put some, we'll put a few tweaks in it. Um, I think we're gonna, sorry, give Jolly his debut. Put Ryan on the bench. Um, yeah, I think I think that's how we're gonna line up. Actually. Put Alex on as well. Sorry, but Alex should go there. I think having Ryan. This is the man so many people have been focusing on ahead of this particular game. Playing against his old club, and I wonder what's going through his mind, Stuart. Well, he should approach. Liam Stewart's the man to watch. He's just got to forget the crowd and go out and play. Going to shake Unai Emery's hand. Come We've got world class. I don't think I changed it. Got Joey starting in his first game. Oh my god. Oh my god. I got. I got a notification on my computer, and we are behind against Villa, Kiers. Oh, what a run. This has to be the leveler, and it is. It's a suey, and it's all level. Yes! Come on! 
<laughs> Sam saying goodbye. The next 60 minutes of this game is basically just pure EA scripting. But the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here. And deliver towards the back post. Not really the ideal clearance. And a oh my god. What is this keeper on? And deciding to go short for this one. Oh my god. We're here at we should be up by more considering the fact that we've had so many chances and plus the one man advantage. That's also a factor. Oh my god, this is really pissing me off now, Watkins. This game. Are you kidding me? You're actually kidding me. Well, no card handed out. He gets away with a rebuke. But a lot of rep and the spot kick is converted as calmly as you like. Well, could this be the turning point? The fans are certainly hoping so. Oh, blocked it! Not away completely. I've got the ball. Who's here though? Good looking sequence. Might be dangerous. Can he finish? Okay, come on, come on, get the ball, get the ball. Get the ball. Zaki scored. Liam! Suey! Liam! Come on. What the hell is on? It's with Adam now. What the hell is the keeper doing? Um. Um, excuse me. It's getting three minutes now. Oh. We had a time, we had a chance for him. Uh-oh, 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 please. Oh no. Why is the time like that? Why is it like that? As soon as I make a substitution there. It's the worst. Jeez. I'm sorry, but that was our worst performance. I think we put Maddie on to start, and then we will we will sub off. Jaden's content. Maybe it's like their wages or something, or their game time. Like Charlie used to be very unhappy. Now she's content, so I think that's good to know. Oh, it's raining though at the Molyneux. All eyes on Gonzalo Guedes. Three goals in his last three games. Gonzalo Guedes. Stay with us on EA TV. They've actually they've got a good player though. Here on the English West Midlands. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the technical and tactical. Really had a chance there. Oh, we can counter here. Tiana to Maddie. Surely, and he scored. That is some good pressing there from like Tiana, Josh, and all that. They got it in the middle with a three on two, I'm pretty sure. Sent Maddie on there. On his bike. That's a beautiful finish. Here we go. Waiting for Josh to get through. And he does. To Maddie. Oh, beautiful assist. 
I said right foot creep, ooh, I'm walking with that eater. Look around, stay low, make sure they don't see. He's hit the gritty. I have to say, the keeper's got his angles all wrong there. That's a poor piece of goalkeeping. It's beautiful stuff there. Adam gets the foot onto it. You know, having Maddie up top really isn't that bad. And that is half time. We're not going to make a single change until the game is fully in our hands. We've got a two goal advantage. Um, yeah. Cross. Well, by Tiana. Gets it to Josh. Gets it to me. Gets it to Zaki. Gets it through to Maddie. Gets it to Adam. Who gets it to Sam. Oh my god. We are absolutely bossing wolves. Now is the time to make some substitutions. We're going to put Liam on. And we're going to give Harry his first game as well. We're going to do that. Um, make three subs. We're going to try and do all five. No. Put Fryer in the midfield. She can actually play there. And... Uh, Actually, put me there, put Freya there, play Alex at a deeper role, and uh, yeah, that's how I'm going to end off the game, play myself at centre back. Manny pulling, putting off a pretty good performance, he was involved in all three goals. Well done by Zaki. And as soon as we make those changes, we can see the goal. And that corner goal. Oh my god, no, not like this. We're bottling this game so hard. We're bottling this game. We're actually bottling this game. Off, Off to Alex. He gets it to Harry. His first start. And his first start. And will that be the goal that ends up securing it for them? He's star lording it. Well, as the replay shows, this is all about his ability to find space in the box, which then makes the finish look so much easier. Finds Ryan. Well, they've controlled most of the game, haven't they? They're one and two touch passing as we Oh, opportunity here. Oh, my God. Suey! Marcus Turam. And the referee huh. blows for full time. This goes down as a Liverpool. It's a good game. game. Well, we talked about their ability to score goals at the top of the game, and once again they delivered. For me, they're always looking for the most dangerous pass, which is a great example to teams that keep us. It is true. Gonna kick off. Team management are gonna rotate the squad heavily. And I mean heavily. I'm gonna start myself. Oh, whoops. Oh well. Prayer was gonna be there anyway. Um, we're gonna rotate quite heavily. We're gonna play Tali. I'm also gonna be playing Shiloh. I'm gonna give. Uh, I'm going to take Harry and put Harry in the reserves, really. Um, we're also going to play Alex. We're going to play John as well. And we will play Michaela. Um, we'll rest Jaden. Play Michaela as well. Okay, yeah, I think that's how we're going to line up after this game. We'll be knowing who I uh, wanted to, who's going on that trip to Greece for four weeks. 
To Maddie. Oh, what a finish. Come on. Come on. Really needed that. Like Tulu. Tulu's. Are you kidding me? What a finish. Oh, you know what? That as well. And there's half time. Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Marks for that pass. Oh, he's through here. Oh, to lose. Score. That should get them believing again. Now counter attacking possibilities. Then can he take advantage? Oh, a goal! They've done it! Quite the combat this. Lately in the games that he's been played in. Straight to the feet. Shiloh. Oh, thank God. Thank God. I feel like got a Premier League game on. Probably shouldn't be playing these guys, though, because we've got a Premier League game on soon. But what am I to know? Some of these players might even be playing for us. Oh, Liam's just found Matty Bain. Oh, thank God. Matty, he's just on fire. Oh. Good defense. Oh. Since when did he become prime? Ruben Diaz and thank God. I then got the email after the game, and I'm not going to show it right now. I'm going to say it to you guys. The five players that are going to Greece on a holiday for four weeks is Alex Saxon. Harry, Ben, oh no, Ben, and who's the last one? Oh no. It's Tiana. And, and they're in Greece right now. You've got to be kidding me. So, you know what? Hopefully, you settle down. Hopefully, you can do bits up against West Ham. Lucas Paqueta. So glad none of the Gibsons left. I don't know, I wasn't going to go. Oh, 
Here we go. Sophie also playing her first game, so that means now Lucas is the only one out of our players to have not played a game. And I go into a first half without scoring a goal. Just like Liverpool in real life. This is absolutely terrible. A chance then for the respective managers to absolutely dreadful. And the second half underway. West Lucas Paqueta. But I tell you what, it's a long way from being settled. Paqueta. Him. Well, oh my god. Well, they can keep possession now. Where's the movement? Where's the movement? Had they gone two down, it would have been a real struggle for them. Come on, Liam. Liam, come on. Silly! Far out, we needed that. We needed that. Oh, well, well left, Zaki, oh, okay, I guess I went third, excuse me, gonna play it to me, who's gonna score? What a positioning. What, uh, sorry, what position? <laughs> oh my God. What positioning that is. Oh, Liam. To Zaki. And he's through. Looking for a cutback. <laughs> what a finish. From Sam on the weak foot, I was expecting it to be like a winning goal celebration. Could have chipped it. Should have. I shouldn't have done the finesse. Okay, that was my bad. I did the finesse. We are top. Thank God. Some of our best players have left, like Saxon, and especially Tiana. She's she's wearing the number eight. I think I might have to give the number eight to someone else. And you'll find out in the next episode. I mean, even if she does apologize, I don't think I'll keep her with the number eight. She's ruined her trust. She's ruined, like, the trust of the whole group. Um, but, yeah. Anyways, we'll find out in the next video.